वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम 1.17 सो स्टेटमेंट इज अ लोड पी इज अप्लाइड टू स्टील रॉड सपोर्टेड एज शोन बाय एल्यूमिनियम प्लेट इन टू विच सिक्स जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स इंच डायमीटर होल हैज बीन ड्रिल नोइंग दैट शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस मस्ट नॉट एक्सीड एटीन के एस आई इन स्टील रॉड एंड टेन के एस आई इन एल्यूमिनियम प्लेट डिटरमाइन द लार्जेस्ट लोड पी दैट कैन बी अप्लाइड टू द रॉड so you can see this is the steel rod clear where p load is applied and this is the aluminium plate that is used to support this steel rod there is a 0.6 inch hole drill in this aluminium plate and the diameter of steel is uh, the upper portion of steel rod is 1.6 inch so you have to find the uh, load p the shearing stress allowable shearing stress for steel is 18 ksi and for aluminum it is 10 ksi so let's start with the solution we know that shearing stress is equal to shearing force per unit area so for this steel plate for this steel if you if you look into it this p load is applied so definitely this will be the shearing area and if i draw it like this so this area will be equal to pi d and thickness is 0.4 into t so i will first find for steel for steel shearing area will be equal to pi d into t so pi multiply by d is 0.6 inch clear again this is this will be the dia where this uh, steel rod may share which is 0.6 and thickness is 0.4 okay so when you calculate it you will get the sharing area for this steel rod comes out to be 0.7540 square inch now we know that uh, sharing stress in steel is equal to sharing force per unit sharing area so what we will do is that we need p so p will be equal to sharing stress in steel into sharing area so p will be equal to sharing stress in steel is 18 ksi so 18 multiply by area is 0.7540 and when you calculate you will get that will be equal to 13.57 kips kilo pounds so this is for steel now what we will do is that we will find the same for uh, aluminum we know that sharing stress in aluminum is equal to sharing force per unit sharing area so area for this now you can see this plates this aluminum plate supports so sharing area will be this one this will be the diameter clear and this diameter is 1.6 and thickness of this plate is 0.25 so again this will be pi d into t pi d into t so pi is 3.1417 multiply by diameter which is 1.6 and thickness is 0.25 so when you calculate it will be equal to 1.25 Double six square inch. Okay. Now put the value again. We will get from here. We will get P will be equal to ta allowable. Uh, sorry, ta allowable in aluminium into A. So P is equal to sharing stress in aluminium into A. So put the value sharing stress in aluminium is ten ksi. You can check it. So ten multiply by this area is one point two five double six, and that will give you uh, one two one twelve point five double six kips, or uh, that is nearly equal to twelve point five seven kips. now you can see you have two loads either you can apply this load or this load so we will choose always we will choose 
the less one we will choose smaller value of p why i will show you in a while p and that is equal to 12.57 kips which is the answer now i will explain the reason why we choose the smaller one let we choose this value p let p is equal to 13.57 kips and we know that tau of aluminium uh, sharing stress in aluminium is equal to sharing force per unit area so 12.57 divided by area of aluminium which is 12.1.25 double six clear and that will be give you 10.79 ksi okay if you look that this is the 10.79 ksi sharing stress will develop in the aluminium which is greater than sharing allowable sharing stress in aluminium and that is 10 ksi so it means that due to this load due to this load it will fail but using this smaller value of p12.5 it, it will satisfy aluminium as well as for steel so that's why we choose the smaller value of uh, p and this is the our correct answer and that was all about this problem one point 17 i hope you have enjoyed this video and you have learned from it those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest videos if you have any question you can ask me in comment section also share my videos and channel with your friends so that they may also learn mechanics of material Thank you for watching.